banished from Earth Classic Game Room broadcasts from the Intergalactic Space Arcade on its never-ending mission to review everything. Welcome to Classic Game Room, where it's time to show alien invaders who's boss with a flamethrower in XCOM Enforcer released in 2001 for the PC. Why am I holding a Game Boy? Because I can. Alright, it's time to waste some aliens. Normally when I think of the XCOM series, I think of strategy games that are plot-driven and detail-oriented. XCOM Enforcer could not be any more different if it tried. This is just straight action. It's like EDF meets Robotron with a flamethrower. And what's not to love about that, except it may not be exactly what fans of the XCOM series were hoping for in 2001. I think this is the last XCOM game that was made before the series was rebooted in 2012 with XCOM Enemy Unknown. Now for some reason the game was giving me difficulties on my Windows 8 PC so I went with an older one and then had issues with direct feed recording. So I'm filming off the screen, it looks better in person, and it sounds pretty good too. But I think you can certainly get a sense for what you're supposed to do here. You run around as an enforcer and blow up aliens while collecting upgrade points that you then apply to your enforcer and make him more powerful. With bigger, better weapons, more armor, and more speed. It's actually a really fun game. If you enjoy Earth Defense Force, I think you'll like this one. It's got a nice sense of humor and it's just non-stop action. There's a wide variety of ridiculous weaponry in the game and hidden stuff everywhere, so explore each level thoroughly. After a while, although it seems like you're pretty powerful, at some point the aliens simply start to overwhelm you and get in your way preventing you from completing objectives like saving humans or destroying their uh, regeneration things. Did I mention it has a flamethrower? Because it does. Visually, XCOM Enforcer is not terribly exciting by today's standards. The environments are all pretty boring and generic, but I can't stress how much fun it is. And the dialogue is entertaining too. The overly cheesy bad movie acting is perfect for this kind of game, which plays a lot like XCOM meets Smash TV. It's also really cheap to pick up these days, you can get it off Steam for next to nothing. Did I mention Smash TV? When do I win a toaster or a new VCR? I wouldn't go into this one looking for anything near the quality of XCOM Enemy Unknown or some of the other XCOM games. but I would go into it looking to blow things up and enjoy some mindless action. Don't forget to collect all of the bonus letters and open up a bonus round so you can upgrade and get your crazy ass weapons, which you're going to want. Needless to say, I've really enjoyed XCOM Enforcer, even though it doesn't have the depth that I've come to expect and enjoy from the XCOM series. It's a really fun game. 
And I've liked every XCOM game that I've played, to be honest. They're all good. So I've got a huge classic game room shout out and thank you to send to Samuel from Manchester, England for sending this to classic game room via Steam. Hey Samuel, is it raining in Manchester? Ah, oh, one of my favorite Vice City lines ever. I like my aliens. Well done. It's XCOM Enforcer. Highly recommended. Three more transporters. <laughs>